What are combustion reactions? A combustion reaction occurs when oxygen combines with a hydrocarbon to produce one or more oxides and water vapor. Combustion reactions release energy in the form of heat and light. Here is an analogy to help you remember the formation of combustion reactions. Sally and George are friends, and Ashley is alone. Ashley decides that she wants to become friends with Sally and George, but she does not want Sally and George to stay friends, so she splits them up and spends time with both of them. There are two types of combustion reactions. First, we have complete combustion. This occurs when a sufficient amount of oxygen is present. A blue flame color indicates that a complete combustion reaction is occurring. For example, ethane gas plus oxygen yields carbon dioxide plus water vapor. A key thing to remember is that when water is produced during a combustion reaction, it is produced in gas form. It becomes water vapor. It is not a liquid. If you want to know how to balance combustion reactions, go check out our balancing chemical equations video. Secondly, we have incomplete combustion. This occurs when an insufficient amount of oxygen is present. A yellow flame color indicates that an incomplete combustion reaction is occurring. The products of this reaction are not just carbon dioxide and water vapor. It can produce carbon monoxide and carbon, which is also known as soot. Soot is hazardous when inhaled. Combustion reactions involve other compounds too. For example, magnesium combines with oxygen to form magnesium oxide. And that's combustion reactions explained quickly. Thank you for watching. Make sure to subscribe to our channel for more chemistry videos and don't forget to press the notification bell. Comment down below any questions you'd like to see answered next.